if you have to sell something or if you open up a kiosk or whatever, you have to have a permit, parks permit to do that. They do that in a lot of areas. Yeah, I mean, remember the tent that we just left? Tents, they do something over there. They, they, they've got a, uh, a marathon over there or some bullshit thing. And uh, they, they've got a permit to set up their tents and, and, and do that shit. Dudes, the permit is cheap. We can go get a cup of coffee at Starbucks if you want. Let me see what time it is. It's uh, 9.30. Now, I'm scheduled to uh, go to work today at 11-ish. It's my own personal schedule, gentlemen. That's it's my game. That's what I usually do. But, I don't know, man. I think I might take it easy today. I don't know, get some sleep. I mean, uh, yesterday. Yesterday, when I was watching the AJ fight, just before the fight, I was fucking falling asleep watching Parker. Parker had a very, very. I, I, I picked the, the Chinese guy to beat Parker, and the Chinese guy did knock him down twice. But Joseph Parker won that fucking fight. He did a hell of a fight, man. A lot of movement, a lot of bending his knees, a lot of lateral movement, a lot of head movement. The Chinese guy couldn't fucking fire. Oh, Christ. My hat got ripped off, gentlemen. The Chinese guy is old. He's 40 years old. I mean, a powerful dude. Doesn't really even have to put much wind up on a punch. He knocked down Joseph Parker twice, man. Anyways, um, man. But when it got into the later rounds, he could not squeeze. He was so tired, you know, from, from the fight. He was having trouble squeezing the trigger on throwing punches. Looks like we do. We got a homeless encampment right there. Nope, that's just floodwaters washing all the homeless mat mattresses out of the... Uh, He's good. I don't know if you can see the the uh, drainage pipes that go underneath the freeway there. The homeless people lived there, got mattresses, and they washed during the heavy rains over here. Every city has got the homelessness problem. Vegas. It's much easier to be homeless here than in Boston or New York City. In New York City, you're probably like, how the fuck do the homeless people survive in that cold, bitter cold? They go in the subway. The subway is, well, apparently it's much warmer than outdoors. But it makes you wonder sometimes, how the fuck can they survive in that bitter cold? I mean, it kills me. Just thinking about it. Don't go trying this shit at home, gentlemen. I'm a professional driver. I can do shit like this. 
but I'll tell you what, man, going pick up that car through the town, oh my god. I would have had a ride. Craig Road isn't too bad, but Nellis, I would have had a ride probably five miles on Nellis Boulevard. Dude, you're taking your life into your hand, own hands there, baby. Pick that up. <laughs> His dog went poop. <laughs> so I told the owner, hey, pick that up. <laughs> he was going to do it. He was going to pick it up. Jesus Christ, is it going to warm up in Vegas? It definitely warmed up about seven degrees probably since when I left. You gotta remember, gentlemen, you're going 25, 30 miles an hour. The wind chill factor can be quite abrasive. Daddy's number one in the world. Oh man, I don't know why I keep thinking Sunday, 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 Sunday. It's fucking Saturday for Christ's sake. You know why? I was watching those fights yesterday. It's very unusual for the fights to be on Friday afternoon. That, um, 